do you want to know what the best job in Bloxburg is? Well, I'm here to tell you just that. So last month, Bloxburg updated to version 0.11.9. And in that update, we had gotten a lot, which is a brand new Bloxburger after Bloxburger just kind of exploded. And we also got an overhauled job system. With the overhauled job system, we get work level experience. So I love 196, which means I earn a lot of money in all my jobs. So the way that this is calculated is all the jobs, all the jobs in Bloxburg that you work at are calculated into the work level experience. But one of the things that Bloxburg had said was that your level 50 job shouldn't matter. Well, I am going to test that out. I'm going to take my fisherman job, start there and go all the way up to fast food worker and work for at least three minutes, three minutes and see which job is the best. And I'll be writing these down. I'll be ranking them. So at the end of this video, I'll be ranking from the worst job to the best job. And you will just have to stay to find out what the best job and the highest paying job is and to see if Bloxburg developers were right and the job systems are better and you earn the same amount of money at each job, no matter what level you are. All right, here we are at the fisherman hut for the fishing job. And obviously I am level one. I've never worked this job before. And our goal is to work for three minutes. I'm going to wait for that to say exactly one minute for me to actually start working. And then we'll go to one that says four minutes. Okay, so this job is very, very boring. And I'm going to calculate the first earning that I get from this job and to see what I get. Okay, so $339 just from this um, job. So um, that is pretty amazing. And I think the jobs are all going to accommodate based on how much you get, if you get a fish, or based on if you throw something. And I, I think that this is going to be really, really good. And each job I go to will determine which job is the best paying job. All right, so we kind of already done um, with this job already, and we have earned at least $5,099 for working at least three minutes straight at the fisherman job. So let's go ahead and end our shift. So that is not bad. $5,000 for working three minutes at the fisherman job with this overhaul of the job system. I think that is really, really nice. Now... Now, now we're just going to head over here to the woodcutters to see how much we earn for three minutes at the woodcutters. All right, so we're going to wait for that to say at least one minute on the clock. So that way we have um, accurate, accurate depictions of what our earnings are going to be. So this job, th this job, all we have to do is chop down trees. So I think this job is going to be based on how many trees I will be able to chop down within three minutes. So this is where the prices might start to vary. But our first price is going to be the big, big notifier what we earn at these jobs. If it is the same, which is about $330, then we know that each job are leveled and we should be earning the same amount of money based on our moves. So we just got to wait a few more seconds for us to chop down a tree. All right. It is time for us to begin chopping down a tree. So obviously this is going to get a little bit boring just watching me chop things down, work at different jobs. But there it is. $434 already. So the jobs do matter. Some jobs pay more and some jobs pay less. That is interesting. This is going to be an interesting outcome to see which one is actually the best job. All right. So we've seen a $2,000 difference from the fisherman to the woodcutter job. This one, $7,000. $7,000 in earnings. That is a lot for a woodcutter. So let's just end our shift. And we have to make our way over to the hairdressers to go ahead and assess that. So in the last video I posted, I already told you about the styles and the, the way that this job works. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip forward to the part when we begin and then when we end the job. All right, so it is one minute on the clock and now we are going to be starting to do the hairdresser job. So let's see, how much does the hairdresser give us on the very, very first hair? $200, $200. Eh, I feel like it could be better. 
I feel, I feel like it could be better. It's proving to be the worst job so far. What I think that this job is going to do, it's going to be based off the earnings about how many, you know, how many customers we get to serve and how fast we actually are. And I think that choosing between all these hairs are going to be super slow. It depends on how fast you are at clicking and stuff. So I think these jobs depend on the, the, how fast you are. All right. It has been three minutes. Three minutes. And we've earned $3,000. Three thousand dollars. The worst. The worst. How can the fisherman be better than the hairstyles? All right. So next up on my list of jobs is seller at Ben's Ice Cream. Now I love ice cream, so Ben's, please, please don't let me down. Don't let me down, Ben. All right. So it is a minute, and I hate that. Okay. So we want two vanillas. So vanilla, vanilla, and you want rainbow sprinkles. Okay, where's the next customer gonna go okay two strawberries that's easy two strawberries so 195 bins is already letting me down of course of course bins let me down bins let me down all right so next up we got janitor we gotta go clean up some graffiti some stuff that has been spilled on the floor and actually this is one of the first jobs i did when i joined in blocksburg so this should be easy. This job shouldn't let me down. The green clean machine cleaning. This guy right here who has served in some of my very cringy role plays. Like, okay. Don't let me down. Like, seriously. Like, I already see a lot of stuff that we could clean up. Like, the new Blocks Burger. Like, okay. Oh, we have the, 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 these trash right here. See? This trash. There's, there, there's trash because this game is trash. I'm just kidding. I love this game. $191. Okay. 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 The fisherman place had set up uh, us up on a very high standards here, being the job I don't work at and giving me at least the most money for starting out of. And not the woodcutter because the woodcutter actually was better. So that says a lot. This is a lot. Okay. You know, the janitor place being a janitor job, I think that this really proves that these jobs are really depicting how jobs are in real life. Next up on the chopping block is the miner at the Blocksburg Cape. Now, I've done this job a little bit because I'm level 7, because I've been trying to do a lot of the stuff for, you know, the Blocksburg update. So all these jobs that I've been working at have been proving to be worse than the beginning. Like, it just keeps getting worse as I keep going up the list. It's like they know. It's like they know that I'm trying to um, see which job is the best, so they leave me with no choice but to say that the first job I worked at was almost the best. It was almost the best. Right now, the woodcutter is like one of the best jobs in Blocksburg. So, let's see. Mining for the first time. What will be the first thing we get? $54. $54. I quit. I already quit. I already quit. I quit. Like, I seriously quit. Working in this job makes me think I'm in Minecraft, mining the ores away, trying to get armor that because of all these blocks. I stand corrected. The miner is the worst job by far. Okay. So this is the job that we can start off right at the bat because it's, you know, the job that's most time consuming, I guess. Oh. Okay, hey, right off the bat, we have to go get bags. 18 seconds, we could have earned money already. But we have to go get bags. $322. I feel promising about this. I feel promising about this job now. With, the, with that much money from the first scan. This job is promising. And I have to jump over here. You know, for a cashier, I think this paid very well. Out of all the jobs, I think this paid very well. But I'm also lying because this is not the highest paying job. This is not the highest earned job I had so far yet. So, 
Let's see. Which job will dethrone? Woodcutter. I walked out of BFF supermarket just to walk back in because my next job is literally right here. I'm going to be a stalker. Well, I'm going to be a stalker. I'm going to... I got to stalk some things. Like... Like... Damn. $159 for the start. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, so I know I didn't show you guys how much I earned at the stocking job, but that was like the worst job. Not the worst job. The worst job I worked at today has to be the minor job. The minor job has to be the worst job ever so far. Nothing has dethroned woodcutter yet, and now we're at my least favorite job. We're going to be being a mechanic. We're going to have to fix things. We're going to have to, you know... um help people and with their poor choices like this one just is very very unruly very very unruly but can i just say that whoever made these outfits for each job in blocksburg chef's kiss chef's kiss i love them i love them so much like very very much all right it's time to start work well the first guy doesn't you know, want to choose an ugly color. He wants to go with black. You're so real for that. You're so real for that. All right. Obviously, I'm going to level nine now. But three hundred dollars from the start, not that bad, given that all you really do is change oil, change color, change wheels and stuff. I think that this job is going to be okay. Be okay. Right there, we have to grab each wheel and we have to change each wheel. By far, I think this job might be the easiest out of uh, out of every single job. I think this one might be the easiest because there's really no way that you can possibly mess up at this job. Like, you know, there's no way you can mess up at the woodcutter job or like the minor job. If you hit TNT, you can mess up in that. But I think this is like the real stupid level if you mess up at this job and real stupid level if you mess up at woodcutter. So, so you know, you know. Not bad for a mechanic. Not bad at all. $4,000 still has woodcutter in first place. That is surprising how woodcutter is in first place. And even my moods are like down a lot so far. So my efficiency is going to be very, very much down since the beginning. But if I still earn a lot more money with my efficiency being down. And all these other jobs that should be paying more. I think this is very interesting and in that the findings I'm getting and this research I'm getting. All right, so next up we have Pizza Baker. And I'm level 15 in this job already, so we have about three more jobs left to do in um, this working challenge thing. Um, and I'm already level 15, so obviously i've worked at this job a lot so you can kind of see with each level i'm currently at in each job you can tell which jobs i like more and i hope that because i have level 15 in this job that i like it because it gives me a lot of money a lot of money like seriously i am pleading to the blocksburg gods let this dethrone woodcutter at least dethrone woodcutter like seriously all right, so now we have to start and add dough, sauce, cheese, and vegetables for veggie pizza. $44. I've lost all hope at this point. I've lost all hope at this point if that's giving me $44 to start off with. Maybe, just maybe, pizza delivery will dethrone woodcutter. I don't know what to say. How about the pizza baker being level 15 at the job and earning a lot less than jobs I have a very, very low level in? That's amazing. Like, seriously. Like, amazing at least. But up next, we have my favorite job, delivery person. This one has to deal with how far each person is for like the pizzas and stuff, which is very interesting that you can get some far away pizzas and some up close pizzas. So in this job, 
prices do vary but two thousand dollars to start off with two thousand dollars to start off with i'm level 36 and at least level 96 in um, work experience and i've earned two thousand dollars that's a one thousand dollar increase than i used to earn before this update so i feel like that each job still has their old earnings everything is still their old earnings but they have just been up to just a little bit based on your work experience and i'm really really excited to see this because um each time i've been leveling up i wasn't getting more earnings um, i guess i would have to level up in the work experience but two thousand dollars for first pizza that's kind of crazy i think we're sprinkling sprinkling a little bit of gold on these pizzas for them to cost this much Woodcutter has finally been dethroned by pizza delivery, everyone's most favorite job, which was ranked the most high paying job before this update. And now the moment of truth is going to finally come out because we're going to be doing the fast food worker job next and seeing if the fast food worker job is truly one of the most high paying jobs in Bloxburg. All right, so we're gonna start off here by jumping over the counter and we're gonna go into the back section. Um, and we're just gonna assemble some burgers. Okay, we're gonna assemble some burgers. Uh, okay, so this, is, this should be really easy now that they updated the assembling. Wait, what was that? Two lettuces and then one tomato. Okay, let's see. $17. Not bad. I'm going to go over here to the cashier to use the register because that's a little bit faster. So we're going to start off with this. Two lettuce, one onion, a small side of fries. And yes, I did get all of that. I did get all of that. Okay. So we'll see how much we earn in three minutes at Fast Food Worker. And this is our final job, working as a fast food worker. Working as a fast food worker. And I'm level 50 and I'm level 96 in um, the work experience level. So now I'm going to calculate um, all the earnings I have and figure out which job is the best job in Bloxburg. Because you guys are going to finally find out which job is the best job ever. Okay, so I have officially ranked all the jobs. So showing up on the screen right now should be all of the job rankings from the worst job to the best job. So at the bottom will be the best job and at the top will be the worst job. So I'm going to go through each and every one of them and it's official rankings tested and proven right here. So at the bottom of the list, we have the minor job, which gave me 1,573. And these are all within three minutes of working. Um, second to last, we have stalker, 2,862. Then we have seller, 3,485. Then we have the hairdressing job, 3,530. Then we go to the janitor, 3,820. Then we go to the mechanic, 4,076. Then cashier, G4186. Then next up would be fisherman, 5099. Now, placing in third place would be the fast food worker, $6,609. Coming in second place will be 700, will be woodcutter, which was seven, $7,359. This was one of the top, one of my top paying jobs for the longest time. So woodcutter being up there is very non-surprising. Now, the best job in Bloxburg, according to my tests, proven right here in first place, is the delivery person job, which gave me $10,314 in three minutes, in three minutes of working. Now, fast food worker, I am level 50. I was improving a lot of efficiency, but I am level 50 at fast food worker, okay? Delivery person, I'm level 36. So obviously, my fast food worker job should have been the most top paying, right? No. Woodcutters, woodcutter, I earned 
$7,000 being level three at the job. So based on all these rankings, fast food worker jumped so high from the last update. You know, all these all of these jobs have changed their rankings. I don't know what these rankings were before, but nothing has so far proven data, proven data, have dethroned delivery person as the highest paying job. Now, obviously, when this update released, a lot of people were making a lot of money at Fast Food Worker. And this has to be based on your moods. Um, if you have Marvelous Mood, Excellent Employee. You know, I have all the game passes. I have all the game passes. So I kind of did all these jobs from going to job to job for three minutes. So each job took me three minutes to complete. And I assessed each and every single one of them. And let's just say that nothing has yet dethroned delivery person. Now, what job do I really recommend you work at? Fast food. Fast food worker by far. I recommend you work at fast food worker. You don't really have to do a lot in there except for assemble burgers and stuff. And it can get a lot of chaotic in there. Um, and like, you know, you can do the cashier job, which the cashier job gotten very, 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 very upped in the new Bloxburger. And when I say cashier job, I don't mean the BFS supermarket cashier job. I mean the Bloxburger cashier job uh, um, fat for the fast food worker. If you really want to make a lot of money real fast, I would say maybe do delivery person, woodcutter, and fast food worker. Those are the top three jobs in Bloxburg, proof of facts. So all this data compiled has really proven that the Bloxburg devs really didn't dethrone our beloved Pizza Planet. So all those people going on those little mopeds going super slow, as you can see in the server I am in right now, I didn't do this in a in my neighborhood. Like I I have one. I didn't do this in my neighborhood because I didn't want to because it would just been a, a little bit different. I wanted to see how it is in a public server. Um, it probably wouldn't have changed any, anything at all. Anyways, but you will still see a lot of people using the mopeds to go around. And I think think that this next update that could come out. Whatever job gets revamped next, we're going to have to assess that pay. And if we assess that pay, I'll have to make a change to the official rankings. If it gets higher or lower based on three minutes of working. But there you have it, guys. Your official rankings for Bloxburg jobs. I want to thank you guys so much for sticking around. If you watched all the way through... Thank you so much. If you didn't watch all the way through and you skipped right here to the end, because um, I put a little bit of, in the description of the video, I put different parts where each job I was at. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. I have more videos coming out um, very, very soon. I'm working on part three of my modern family home speed build, so obviously watch out for that. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. And if you haven't already, join my Discord server. Link is in the description. I chat in there almost every day now. And I also be playing around with my Discord bot, Switch. Obviously, um, join there so you can invite the bot. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I know I said that a lot of times already. <laughs> okay. Well, anyways, bye. I'll see you in the next video. And please, please, please join my Discord server. And please, please like this video, share it, and subscribe. I'll see you guys all later. Bye now.